Now let's talk a little bit about non-benzodiazepine hypnotics. The mechanism of action of these drugs I've already mentioned in the introductory video on sedative, hypnotic, and zeolytic drugs, but just for the sake of completeness, I'll mention it here. They basically act on the benzodiazepine receptor on the GABA-A complex and mediate GABA action and facilitates it and increase chloride channel opening. The pharmacokinetics pharmaco are simple. They are orally administered, have a short half-life with a rapid onset and metabolized by cytochrome B450. Now their only use is in insomnia as I previously mentioned that they basically act on the alpha-1 subunit of the GABA-A complex and that is responsible only for sleep. The effects are that they have a less effect on REM compared to benzodiazepines. They do not have effects on sleep patterns. They produce nearly normal sleep like benzodiazepines, have minimal hangover effects like less daytime cognitive impairment and no rebound insomnia. They have no action on anxiety, I repeat again. No action on convulsions and no muscle relaxing property. On interacting with other CNS depressants as they, they themselves are CNS depressants, they can increase the risk of respiratory depression, coma and death. For example, ethnone, opioids, TCAs and antihistamines. Now the drugs involved in the non-benzodiazepines, we'll discuss four of them. One is Zolpidem, next is Sopiclone, another one is Zeliplon, and the last one is S. Zopiclone. Now, Zolpidem is used for the short term treatment of insomnia, and so are Zopiclone and Zeliplon. Zeliplon is the shortest acting non-benzodiazepine -benz hypnotic and s -zopiclone can be used both in short term and long term therapy. Now Zopiclone has uh, some side effects which are headache, drowsiness, GI disturbances and a metallic taste in the mouth. All of the others have the same CNS depressing effects like now in case of toxicity non-benzodiazepines can be antagonized by flumazenil because we can see that they attach to the benzodiazepine receptors 